we're gonna talk about how to talk to your children about a divorce. It's fairly well known that children of divorced parents tend to go through difficult times before, during, and after a divorce. So the effect of a divorce can be a long lasting contribution to shaping how children view a marriage and a family. I'd like to help you and help you with your children get through this divorce process. I understand the challenges of the divorce and its impact on the entire family structure. The psychological effects on divorce in children, it's typically stressful for all children. Some will cope better, but let's break those ages down now into even more of an age group. If you're divorcing when your children are quite young, you might hear people say, don't worry, they won't remember. However, this might not necessarily be true. A research study conducted in 2000 2011 found that many children actually remembered very early on in their lives. However, as time passes, children are able to forget some of these early childhood memories. But it's important to realize that it doesn't mean it will not affect them. Parental separation for children under the age of three. This is a tough one. They're young. They might become fussier when one parent is not around. They're harder to console. They might be more clingy or insecure around new people as well as the parent that they're living with. They also may regress or miss developmental milestones. In addition, as these are formative years, the situation can be handled by having lasting effect and may cause more problems down the road. So there's a few ways we can ease the pain of transitioning your young children to a divorce. Set and maintain that consistent routine with as little disruption as you can. Make sure both parents are really also on board with keeping a routine. We don't want one household to have a really late bedtime or no structure and the other to have the bedtime and the structure that is age appropriate. Create that loving and secure environment with both parents and expose the children to new people in emotionally safe ways. While it seems that although they progress slow at this age, it's best to remember the steps you take now will help their emotional well-being as they become older. Be patient and kind with that child as you are with one another as you work through this challenge together. And if your child is experiencing the loss of a parent or you're finding yourself in the situation of single parenting, just do your best to create that secure love and support your child in the environment. That's for under the age of three. I'm hoping that this might give you a little bit of insight on how you can talk to your children regarding a divorce. Again, I'm here from O'Connor Family Law. The firm website is familylawma.com for more information. And I really hope that you have a great rest of your day.